Hello everyone, welcome to Paradise on 18 Wheels. Lori's going to give me a haircut. She's going to show you how easy it is. Yeah. <laughs> she actually cuts my hair, everyone, so... Uh, did you go to school for this, babe? No. She did not go to school for this, but uh, she gives really good haircuts, so... If you guys ever see us at the truck stops... Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'm not a beautician, everyone. Okay, go ahead. We're going to go ahead and show you guys. Hey, babe. Mm -hmm. Make me look GQ. I'll do my best. I always do. By the way, everyone, happy Halloween. It is Halloween today, October 31st, 2021. Last year we were not home for uh, Halloween, but this year... It wasn't fun either last year, um, being out on the road. We were out on the road for Halloween and... Thanksgiving and Christmas and New Year's and New Year's it was uh, I would never do that ever again ever in my career I would never do that I it's very depressing you know not being with family members it's not worth it I don't care if the company offers you an extra hundred dollars pay or you know it's just not worth it right babe yeah I agree. It's very depressing. Yes. Even though we spent what? We spent Christmas or New Year's in uh, Orlando, Florida. Christmas Orlando and New Year's in Texas. That was. We might have been in uh, Orlando and for the holidays, but it's weird when you're over there. Because it's so warm, you know, it's like 90 degrees and it's Christmas and it's just, it throws you off. It doesn't feel the same. Like, you know, we're, we live here in Seattle, Washington, and, you know, it feels like Christmas because it's, the weather's changed. And people decorate. Yeah, they're in Orlando. They don't decorate like they do here in uh, the Pacific Northwest. Um, and it's weird going to the, going to the Walmarts over there during the holidays, everybody's wearing shorts, muscle shirts, flip flops, that heavy breathing and, uh, different noises down below. That's actually, uh, English Bulldog. She always has to be in the video. Some way, somehow, she makes to make noises. Usually she's playing with her uh, toy. Hopefully she don't grab it now, but I said toy. Her toys are uh, squeaky toys. She loves the squeakies. Hey, there's uh, you got a little audience down below. Be careful. Down your big mirror so you can see the difference already. Oh, I trust you. She always gives me good haircuts. So, guys, send me a message. Send us uh, your comments. Let us know how Lori uh, did on the haircut. Yeah, especially since you're volunteering me to cut other people's hair. Every time she cuts <laughs> my hair, I get a lot of compliments from a lot of people. Yep. Yeah. They really like my haircuts. The nice thing about Lori cutting your hair is she cuts your hair with scissors and not a, a clipper. You know, like the barbers and the hairstylists, they like to use those clippers on your hair, which is very bad for your, for you. It, Makes your hair stand up and stick out sideways on the sides. 
when you get your hair cut, you should always ask them to use scissors, not the clippers. That's what I've been told anyways by professional hairdressers at expensive salons. The only reason why the ladies at the salons like to use the clippers because you're like uh, cattle. They want to get you in and out so they can get the next customer in there. They're after those tips. You ever see the cars that they drive when you go to their salons, babe? No. Always driving nice cars. Acuras, Mercedes, BMWs. But it never fails. Every time I go to a salon, I'll tell the girl, cut my hair a certain way, one ear and right out the other. They don't even, they don't cut it the way you want it to be cut. They cut it their way. So I hope everyone's having a good Halloween. The sun is about to go down here in Seattle. Won't be too long before we start getting some uh, trick-or-treaters here. And we get some really cool trick-or-treaters that come here. They're really nice costumes. They go all out over here with their costumes. Even the parents get in, wear costumes and it's really cool, huh, babe? Yes. Yeah. Sorry, guys. One of us is concentrating. <laughs> so I'm doing the talking while she cuts because she has scissors, guys. <laughs> and he doesn't. He hasn't learned not to move yet. So if you see blood, it's probably real. <laughs> huh. Was that my hint to shut up? No. <laughs> no, I'm just saying that I've got to concentrate, otherwise you're gonna have some you wild have a bald spot. Looking hair. Exactly. That's what gel's for, babe. So if you mess up, I'll just throw some gel on there. Did you hear even... that everybody? You're my witness. If I mess up this hairdo, he has gel. Exactly. That's why when you go to the barber shops. Because they know they didn't cut your hair the way you wanted it. So they always say, would you like us to put some gel in your hair? It's because they don't want you to see their mistake. <laughs> see how what he's learned? Mm-hmm. And everybody always says, oh, yeah, put some gel in there. And now he comes to Lori's barbershop. They look all cool with the gel. They think they got a really good haircut. Then after they take their shower, their first shower... Then they really see, oh my God, she messed up my hair. It's a good thing grow, the hair grows back though, right? Way to stay positive. Just throw some gel in your hair. If you go to, a, somebody messes up your hair, guys, nobody will know anything and uh, your hair will grow back. Before you know it, you won't have to put the gel in your hair anymore. <laughs> well, how long does it take my hair to grow back, babe? Not very long. You Three weeks. fast. About three weeks from now, four weeks for sure, I'll need another haircut. The good thing is, is you won't need it because it's a bad haircut. But Lori likes me to have <laughs> long hair, so what? I get a haircut from you about once there. What was the last time you gave me a haircut, babe? Mm, Two months ago? Five weeks. Yeah, I'd say five weeks. Has it been five weeks now? Probably. She likes me with long hair. Mm, well, Well, depends. not long, long, but... It depends. It depends. She doesn't like the... The military haircut. I don't like the bald look. Well, I don't even say that because some guys look good bald, but yeah. I like you to look GQ. How's that? You know, before I met Lori, I did shave my hair off completely. Like, I was bald, bald. All you saw was skin. Can you imagine that, everybody? <laughs> my mother saw it. Did she cry? <laughs> I think so. I believe it. I think she shed a tear. Because this man has gorgeous hair. <laughs> it's hard that he would want to cut it all off. It's hard to believe. 
I just like having short hair. I like being uh, clean cut. Um, I feel better about myself. That's too clean cut. When I have long hair, I just, I just feel out of place. I don't want it long. There's a happy medium. There's always a happy medium. I've always kept uh, military short haircuts. Is that because you run the ROTC thing? Yes. So you've got that background. That's mm -hmm. why it's probably inbred in you a little bit. And I've always had short hair. My mom kept our short, kept our hair short when we were growing up as little boys. You know. What do you guys think of my beard? <laughs> it's the first time I've ever grown a beard. And uh, it takes a while to grow. Uh, how long have I been growing this, babe? Mm, at least a couple of months. Yeah, it takes a while. The older you get, the longer it takes to grow. Um, but I'm not going to shave it. I'm going to let it get where it's covering my face. I'm not going to like look like uh, a mountain man or anything like that. Did you buy your scissors and comb on Amazon? Yeah, I'm sure you did. This, uh... That, definitely. I just bought that recently. I've had the scissors for a while. So check out the links below of this video, and, uh... We'll link all this stuff. You can buy it right off of Amazon. The yeah. scissors, the comb, and what do you call this that I'm wearing? Cape. A cape. to keep it quiet while I cut by his ears. See, he does learn. He's trainable. Hi everyone. Uh, welcome back to Paradise on 18 Wheels. I just wanted to show you I finished the haircut and what it looks like after I cut his hair. Let me know what you guys think. Alright, spin around. Let's see how I did. Keep going. Here we go. This is it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye-bye.